Viewers, welcome back to my channel. This is Ranjir Raj, and you are streaming on the Steady Beast. So, in today's topic, I'll be solving uh, some problems and also discussing uh, some concepts regarding the steady state parameters uh, in the computer simulation modeling. So, here are some few concepts and some problems uh, which we are going to discuss and some of the parameters uh, which you need to know before solving this problem. So let's get started. So first of all, uh, we have some uh, thing called as the arrival rate. So whenever uh, in the problem uh, we encounter arrival rate, it is denoted by lambda and its unit are customers per unit time. Then comes the average service time that is the ES which is 1 by mu and mu is the service rate that is uh, mu customers per unit time and C is the Q capacity and the average server subsystem time would be represented as W which would be equal to the ES and which uh, in turn would be equal to 1 by mu and uh, then we have some parameters called as the steady state parameter now there are two types of queuing system like the single server and multi server and for single server queuing system it would be lambda W so it is lambda into W that is ES and the value of ES is 1 by mu so it would be lambda by mu so for a single server queuing system the uh, server utilization would be lambda by mu and for a multi server queuing system one parameter would be added to this that is 1 by C into mu that is C would be the capacity of the system now this was the some concepts regarding the steady state parameters now let us move on to the very first problem and the very first problem says that Customers arrive at random to a restaurant at the rate of 40 customers per hour. Currently, there are 10 waiters each serving six customers per hour on average. Now, you have to find the steady state average utilization of the server and the average number of busy servers. So, from this, uh, you have the arrival rate. That is, the arrival rate is lambda. So, you have 40 customers per hour now there are uh, 10 waiters each in the system so uh, the capacity that would be 10 waiters uh, this means that uh, in the restaurant there are 10 waiters that is the queue capacity and each serving 6 customers so mu will be 6 in this case now let us uh, construct the formula so first of all there are asking for the steady state average utilization and since it is a multi-server, since there are many waiters in the restaurant, uh, you will be solving for multi-server and it would be lambda by C into mu. So value of lambda would be 40 divided by C into mu that is 10 into 6. The value comes out to be 0 0.6667. Now uh, this is the, uh, that is the LS, that is the steady state parameter. Now, uh, you have to find the total number of busy servers in this case. So, the busy servers are denoted as lambda by mu. So, it would be 40 by 6. So, just keep the value as it is and it would be some answer in decimals. So, this was the very first problem in solving this. Now, the second problem says that there is a lawyer. You have to consider a lawyer who gives appointments to his clients after every 15 minutes. The appointment duration of the ith client SI minutes is given by this that is 10 minutes with probability 0.8 and 18 minutes with probability of 0.2. You have to find the steady state average utilization of the servers. So in this uh, it is saying that um, customers or the clients arrive after every 15 minutes. So it is the arrival rate and arrival rate is one customer after every 15 minutes. So it will be 1 by 15 clients per minute and it is not 15. Next it says that there are uh, two SI values that is S1 and S2 uh, that is S1 would be the average service time. So S1 that you will calculate as 10 into 0 0.8 and S2 that is the ES1 and ES2 uh, that is 18 into 0 0.2 now the mean value of this would be ESI so ESI would be ES1 plus ES2 which would come up to be 11.6 and the unit is customers or clients 
per minute. Now this is the value. Now you have to calculate the inverse that is the uh, service rate. Service rate would be inverse of this that is uh, 1 by 11.6 that would come out 0 0.086 value that is customers per unit time that is clients per minute. And now you have to calculate find the steady state average utilization. Now since it, this is the single server feeding system so you will use lambda by mu and lambda is 1 by 15 so I will write it as 15 inverse divided by that is 11.6 so the answer comes out to be 73 point some value so percentage so in percentage uh, if you represent this then uh, the lawyer would be busy for 73 percentage of most of it this time so this was all about the steady state parameters uh, solve problem and the concept so hope you enjoyed this video if you found this video helpful please hit the like button and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe thanks for watching this video